जय हिंद फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक ऑन द टॉपिक ऑफ क्लाइमेट चेंज एंड दिस टॉपिक इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इन द एस एस बी लेक्चरेट सो इफ वी स्टार्ट फ्रॉम द बिगिनिंग इफ वी स्टार्ट फ्रॉम द डेफिनेशन ऑफ द क्लाइमेट चेंज द क्लाइमेट चेंज इज रेफर्स टू द ड्रास्टिक चेंज इन द वेदर पैटर्न इट मीन्स फ्रॉम एशियन टाइम टिल नाउ वी आर फेसिंग we are seeing that climate changes time to time but now the climate change or a global warming is a very drastic or devastating condition it's a huge change in climate or weather pattern from the 1750 or we can say that industrial revolution the climate change has begun very drastically because of the emission of carbon dioxide methane and some other greenhouse gases the average temperature of earth is increasing day by day at a drastic level and this is because the every country wants to increase its economy but they are not taking those steps which are important for reducing the climate change or reducing the drastic change in temperature we are blindly moving to a destructive life and why it is so we want more and more economic revolution more and more money but we never thought about the climate or the environment of the earth the environment of the earth is a blessing to us by nature it never ask anything in return but we are blind we are destroying forests the emission of industrial waste we are pouring it into sea rivers and why it is so there is no strict rules there is no legislations for this industrial sectors for building more and more and more industrial areas for colonies we are cutting trees we are destroying forests so because of this the forest level is decreasing day by day the forest forests are the most important thing they play a eminent role in decreasing the level of carbon in environment they soak the carbon from environment carbon dioxide from environment and give us oxygen they use it in photosynthesis and we are destroying those forests the intergovernmental climate change council it says that till the end of this century our earth temperature will be increase in between 1.5 degree celsius and 4.5 degree celsius and have you ever noticed about this this is a very drastic change if this happen then the earth will be not inhabited to the human being or any other creature bacteria virus animals birds nothing will survive here the increase or the change in temperature is there but this is changing very drastically if we see from last 100 years or 150 years the earth temperature increasing very drastically and it was never happened in the whole history of earth or human civilization this industrialization making this change query destroying devastating the time is still here if we take some steps to reduce it 
or to tackle it the governments businesses and various sectors are taking steps to decrease the change in temperature the cop 26 and various other international or intra governmental inter governmental committees summits are taking place but talking on this topic is not on the related this only if we want us something achieve something in this respective area we need to reduce carbon emission in the environment and how it is possible see in every year we are emitting near about 4 lakh ton carbon emission in the environment and if we want to reduce it then we have to do some we have to take some steps like we need to reduce the use of fossil fuel we need to use some uh we need to use solar energy wind energy which are renewable we can use hydrogen for our energy use the thermal energy is a very uh, very important role play the thermal energy plays a very important role in this sector the bhutan it is a carbon negative country and why it is so they have huge amount of forest area and this change happened after the industrial revolution the america stands number at number 1 in carbon emission at a 27% the china second at 14% India is also playing eminent role in a climate change because the carbon emission by India is seven percent and it stands at seven at third number. If we start using public transport, if we start reducing the meat in our day-to-day life, if we if there is a not a huge difference between two places if we walk on then that will be help in our fighting with climate change so these all things are there and the governments in international communities has to make legislations to tackle with this problem if we not work now then it will never be achieved by us because of climate change the coral reefs are destroying devastating some countries are facing the problem of submerging sea indonesia bangladesh sri lanka the other archipelagos are facing this problem the glaciers are melting in a very huge manner and the sea level is increasing devastatingly and because of that the islands are facing this problem of submergence some of the species of animals birds and other creatures destroyed they are not destroyed from earth and this is affecting on our food cycle if one species get evaporated or destroyed then the other species depend on on that will not survive for long time and if this happens then the human being is not exception for this rule some sea creatures sea ocean animals are losing their habitats they are losing their own area their habitats and moving to some other and because of this the food chain is getting affected 
so if we if we start working on it if the developed countries leave their ego aside for some time and they help the developing and underdeveloped countries to reduce carbon emission then the world will be something different so on this matter i just want to say if the international community the governments start working on it the businesses then the time is not no longer that the carbon emission will get reduced and the climate change will be a no problem before us so we need to work together and tackle this problem so thanks for your time jai hind